So what nutrients are we missing if we have a weakened immune system? Well, I think everyone needs to be on the same three things, the basics, right? Because there's no um, getting around the basics, right? Like they say, you can't uh, exercise your way out of a bad diet, right? You can't um, um, eat your way around poor sleep, right? So there's some, some absolute basics that we all need. I think everyone should be on a methylated multivitamin. By methylated, all that means um, is that these, we don't assume that your body can convert anything. We assume that we need to convert it all for you. So you're gonna get the already converted version of certain nutrients. You're still gonna get the B complex of vitamins, but you're gonna get a version of B12 called methylcobalamin. You're gonna get a version of folate called methylfolate. So when so you, you like the multi, not like a methylated B, you like the full methylated multi? B. Yeah, I like a full multi. Full multi. Okay, right? sorry, just to clarify. It should have methylfolate. It should have the complex of B vitamins. It should definitely have a form of B12 called methylcobalamin. Okay. You should avoid the most common form of B12, which is called cyanocobalamin. If, if you look at, you know, the word essential means necessary for life, right? So what is essential for human beings? There are eight essential amino acids. If you're deficient in any one of these amino acids, there are consequences, and I can explain what those are. Um, there are two essential fatty acids right? EPA and DHA, mm. um, fatty acids. If you're deficient in these fatty acids, um, there are consequences. There is no such thing as an essential carbohydrate. So if you let that settle in for a second, um, there is no such thing as an essential carbohydrate. They are not necessary for life. What's necessary for life are fats and amino acids. So if someone's um, listening, Methylated multivitamin. Methylated multivitamin. An, e an EPA that has a DHA. Either a fish oil or a plant-based oil. Um, oh. Omega-3 um, fatty an acid that has an EPA and a DHA okay. fatty acid in it. We right? take Those momentous. You like momentous? Yeah, momentous is great. Um, and um, and you can take these from plant or from animal sources, right? Okay. So if, you, if you're vegan or vegetarian and you don't want to take a fish oil, you can take a, you know, black seed oil. Um, so... There you get the fatty acids. Um, and I think everyone should be, I mean, with very few exceptions, should be on a vitamin D3 with K2. I mean, D3 is probably the What's most- What's your favorite? Um, again, I'm, I'm making one, but uh, there are lots of good D3s that are out there. Um, uh, there's some liquid forms. What's an amino acid that comes with all eight? Okay, um, the best that I have found is one by Body Health and it is called Perfect Aminos. The thing about this amino acid um, is it's all eight of the essential amino acids. Um, it has a single calorie. So if you work out in a fasted state, it will not even break a fast. Interesting. And it's all eight of the essential amino acids. It will not break a fast and it's 99% absorbable. So it has the equivalent of 29 grams of whey protein. So you'd have to have almost 30 grams of whey protein to get to the, these eight essential amino acids. See, I think amino acids are, are, are really poorly understood because most people think that proteins um, are amino acids. They're, I mean, amino acids are proteins, they're not. Amino acids are the building blocks of proteins, right? So amino acids build all of the different proteins, collagen, elastin, fibrin, muscle, natural killer cells. We cannot target direct protein. Like, so for example, we, uh, we don't need our nails to grow our nails and we don't need our hair to grow our hair, but Marketing has led us to believe that we can eat collagen to grow collagen. Collagen, like steak or eggs or whey or any other protein, will become the exact same thing when you put it in the human body. It will become amino acids. Collagen is actually not even a complete protein. It can't build muscle because it's missing a blood amino acid. So if you want to build collagen, elastin, fibrin, you want to have healthy, vibrant skin, you also want to build muscle. You want to have the raw materials to build natural killer cells that defend, you know, the defenders in your immune system. You take essential amino acids and then your body can build everything from that. 